The guy we're looking for is straight ahead. Contrast Into man. the deep, dark, swampy beyond. There he is. Not see him. Not see him. Oh, well, oh crap! Pull back! Pull back! Don't attack him. Too late. I hope we could deal with these box scales first. Now they decide to attack us, but no. Whereas I think we can take. What is that horrible noise? No idea. Just concentrate up. Great, now our healer is dead. And now she's up again. I'm look, I'm, look, I know you have a problem with this, but please help protect the healer, okay? Okay, second time I failed to protect the healer, sorry. That's... And see about this down. Look, we can't just focus on the enemy. We also need to ensure that our own are kept alive. Especially the healer, because without her, well... We are sort of doomed. I know. Yeah. I apologize, but I hope it sort of redeems me that I took down the guy. Yeah, yeah, I'm just trying to get it in. I mean, right now it's not that bad. Okay, a couple of times it has been, but... But it could potentially... Be worse. Yeah, it probably... Far worse. Exactly. But I just need to ask before we proceed, do we need to go further in here? Nope. Phew. Okay, as you were saying before. We have to go to Nebo now. So, and since that requires tra uh, trekking across a lot of ground, we're already covered. We'll just Hold on, ahead. should I talk to this guy first? Nope. Oh. Hey people, we figured we could go this way, so there was still something we could show you. Ugh. Ugh. What? Hard and hump. Yep. What's weirder, that we pick these up or there's actually someone who wants them? No comment. I just salvage it and turn it into a piece of leather. Huh. me that axe. Yes. Why? I need to salvage it. And it is not like that you can use axe for anything. Yes! I think I have enough now. Oh no. Moving ahead. Well, the use nice. Indeed. And I there's need to... a lot of stuff down there. And that looks like almost the entrance to a cave, but I do not know. But why do we not have beaches like that in Denmark? Environmental reasons. <sighs> you must remember, Denmark is primarily formed from landmass pushed down from Norway and Sweden after the Ice Age. Not mm. primary conditions for the type of beach you see in more sunny environments. So no real sunny tropical environments. Well, the weather, the climate in general, is not conductive to tropical environments. 
Maybe we'll get that with global warming, but then again, we might also just get a whole lot of water where we used to live, so who knows? Yeah, who really knows? Personally, I can do it with warmer weather, but we also have some good summers, I suppose. If you want warmer weather, move south. Oh, Germany? Well, yeah, I suppose that would be marginally warmer than here. I know that I usually complain about the cold and such, but I feel like a wimp when I say that. My ancestors would wave through ice water without even whimpering. I am a disgrace to my heritage. Don't be ashamed, a lot of Danes I know, you include, are pretty sensible to the cold. Hell, my sister is extremely sensitive. Like ridiculous. So, what the hell is that over there? Something is hurling. What? Ancient Okan. The trees are attacking us. Oh, Lord. Quickly, fans. Make up a lot of race references now. Down you go, Treebeard. Will that thing count as an entity? <laughs> okay, fine, fine. That was good. Thank you. Hold on. I have something that you might identify for me. Well, trouble. Hold on. Here. Oh. An essence pauldron. Unless you can use it yourself, of course. Such blasphemy to see the dead walking again. Hmm. You know, I actually got a funny thought. I would have actually imagined her going out to a graveyard and uh, using some kind of ram's hammer and smack the dead when it, they come up from a grave like wag a mole instead of wag an undead. And we're almost at the village. Just need to cover a little more ground and it should be... It's right over there, in fact. Whee! Oh, great. Come on, lightning orb! Uh, apparently that was not necessary. It's a shame this doesn't count as an outpost or a city or as whatever. It would be nice to be just be able to walk over here, but oh well. Hmm. Settlement guards. Now to Nepo Terrace. So yeah, it looks like we've gotten into a big open environment again. Hmm. But I'll say this is a bit, much better place to look at than uh, Ascalon. That ended up getting a bit <laughs> boring. Yeah, and as I was saying before, or at least about to, I did not really like the uh, entire dwarf thing. I know the mountains were cool and all that, but yeah, it sort of got old. Oh, well, I'll, I'll say the Shiver Peaks area didn't drag on the same way Ascalon did. Yeah, at least there was some very easy things around us. But I prefer this lush jungle area. Of course, of course. I'd say Ascalon ended up dragging on too long, but maybe that was just because we took all the side quests and you ended up looking at this brown wasteland for far too long. Shiver Peaks, good length, could have gotten repetitive, but they kept it to a nice length, and this place looks nice and varied. So, yeah. Okay. Let's see. I um, will just have to... The Temple of Aegis is not too far from here. I would very much like to see its hard halls. Okay, maybe we should let her see the Temple of Aegis. I just thought one of the uh, feather brains had spotted us. 
Ah, another village. Hmm, nice. None of this is better than what I already have on this. Uh, one energy is not worth that. Couldn't buy it anyway, but still. Ethan the Artisan. Hey hero, I'm Ethan the Weaver. Can I interest you in some of my handmade linen? It's totally organic. What's on your mind, friend? Ah yes, I've been expecting you. I hope this is the beginning of a much fruitful trade between the Ascon settlement and our village. And Inspector Caleb will might as well just see what he has to say. I have a matter that I need to some discreet help with. Three days ago, in Bergen Hot Springs, two members of the Lion Guard were brutally slain. Initial evidence suggests that it was the work of the Shining Blade, but something strange is going on. There were four witnesses, but none of them would speak with me when I interviewed them. I believe that at least one of them might be willing to talk to someone who is a little less official. An outsider, so to speak. I'll be grateful if you would travel to Bergen and obtain written testimonies from the four witnesses. Okay. Interesting. Murder mystery. Well, they didn't expect that. Don't know why the guy would trust us to do this, but maybe he's already heard about me. Yeah, who knows. And really, I need to be honest, when I hear Inspector, some part of my brain automatically thinks about Inspector Fix of Scotland Yard. Huh. But, yeah. Maybe I just watch too much around the world in 80 days. Regardless, is an Inspector not a pretty high police rank? I think so. I'm not too certain, but I think so. I think it is a tad higher than constable that would... Yeah. I know nothing about military or police ranks. I'm not too familiar either, I must admit. Ice tools. Oh damn, we completely forgot to turn in the quest for those reverse the scales. Oh well, we can do that later. It's not like it's that far from the entrance. Just a small trip, that's all. Mm. But yeah, something is definitely going on. Spells like Demonic Flesh and Deathly Swarm. Shit is going down pretty real. Seems like all scales, uh, at least all box scales, are inherently necromantic. Hmm. Strange. Let's see. Uh... I have to do that too, so we had to go back anyway. Uh, yeah. Oh well. Skeletons. Okay, we're in undead territory apparently. And there's a Crichton chest up there. Can I try and get it, or? Um... Well, isn't it like use it multiple times or something like that? No, you can only use one key per chest. Hey. Damn, those things are good. Oh crap, a healer! Oh 
Oh crap, I'm spell hit a lynx. This is going really well right now, I tell you. Everyone okay? What? All this for a full hammer? Yep. Probably enchanted. Let's see. No comment. Hmm. Does fire damage and gives bonus to health. Interesting. Hmm. Still no thanks. And yeah, I have the iron ignorance I need.